A first grader at Dayton Christian is putting his skills to good use, helping workers on the front lines. Two News reporter Kelly King shows us how he's giving health care workers a little comfort during this time. I feel pretty good. And six-year-old William Scott should. To many, he's a lifesaver, or better yet, an ear saver. An ear saver. For the past week. I like watching it so like I can know when it's done. He's been busy. I bought it when 3D printing was still fairly new um, as something to tinker with. William has now taken over 3D printing ear protectors. His mom, a physician at Dayton Children's. The masks are uncomfortable enough to breathe in, but they're necessary and you know we're all willing to wear them, but then when it starts wearing on your ears too, that's unnecessary. William with his ear protectors to the rescue, also helping the group making masks for Dayton. People on the front line, they're like, Oh my goodness, can I put in for workers comp for sore ears? William is the youngest volunteer for making masks for Dayton. So far, he's created nearly 100 of these ear protectors. Once we knew we were going to make them and we got the 3D printer, dad got it out instead of the first few. Each one takes roughly 20 to 30 minutes to print. The family's basement turned into William's workspace. Pretty much everyone I passed in the hallway at work snatched one as I was walking by. If demand isn't testament enough, it feels good. This is, and behind his little hands, a big heart, probably unaware of just how much of an impact he's making. If we can do little things by making masks or making ear protectors, it all helps. We're really proud of him, and I don't think he, he knows how much he's contributing. Kelly King, 2 News, working for you.